Register on Xcode via www.nokitcards.com to access our exclusive promotion. Enter your email and click Continue. You'll receive a verification code by email. Check your spam or trash folder if it doesn't arrive right away. Enter the code, then set and confirm your password. Next, complete the extra security verification. Great, you're now registered on Xcode. You'll land on the application home screen, where you can order your first crypto debit card or deposit crypto assets. Please note, you must deposit crypto before ordering a card. Let's click, order crypto card, first. A pop-up will appear prompting you to create a trade password, an extra security layer. Click, set up now. You'll then be prompted to bind your Google Authenticator for added security. Click, bind now. You have two options, scan the QR code with your Google Authenticator app or copy and paste the provided key into the app. I'll go with scanning the QR, it's quicker. After scanning, enter the temporary code shown in your app for your Xcode account. Done, Google Authenticator is now bound. Now, let's set your trade password, a six-digit code that's easy for you to remember. Enter it once, then again to confirm. You'll need to input the Google Authenticator code one more time to finalize the setup. Perfect, your trade password is now active. We have one last security step, binding your phone. Your phone information is encrypted and not accessible to the Xcode team. For added privacy, you can use a prepaid number. Click on Bind Phone. Enter your country code and phone number. That's it, your number is now successfully linked. Now let's go back to the main menu and click on Cards. Scroll down and click Get Instantly. Here, you can choose between Essential, Premium or Whale. I'll select Whale, scroll down and click Get Whale Card now. To set up your crypto debit card, first enter a name and surname, this doesn't need to be your real name. Tick the box to agree to the terms. Don't forget, you can choose between Visa and MasterCard here. Scroll down to see the total cost and the payment currency, USDT is required. Make sure you have enough USDT in your Xcode balance. In this case, I don't have any. If I did, I'd click Confirm and the card would activate in seconds. Let's go back to the main menu so I can show you how to deposit crypto. Under Assets, click the Deposit icon to add funds from an exchange or another wallet. Click Withdraw to send assets from your Xcode account to an external wallet. And use Send to transfer funds to another Xcode user, similar to Neobank apps like Revolut. You can also deposit funds through your existing cards if you're low on balance. Go to Cards and select a card. I'm low on funds on this card, so I click Recharge. A pop-up appears letting me know I have no balance and asks if I want to deposit. Click OK. That takes me straight to the deposit menu. You can deposit USDT via BSC or Tron Networks with a minimum deposit of 15 USDT. I'll use the Tron Network this time. Just like sending crypto to any wallet, scan the QR code or copy the provided address into your exchange or wallet app. 
I sent 50 USDT, within seconds, the balance appears in my Xcode account. I refresh the app to see the updated balance. Now I can use these funds to buy a new card, if the balance is enough, or recharge an existing one. Let's recharge my current card. I click, cards, then I select my whale card. I click, recharge. I choose, USDT, and select the recharge amount, in this case, I'll use the maximum available. I don't have a voucher, so I click, recharge. Review the confirmation screen and click, confirm. Enter your trade password. And that's it, your card is now topped up. The balance typically updates instantly, so you can use your card right away. Click to card manage to view your updated balance. To see full card details, click card info. Enter your trade password. You'll then see your name, card number, CVV, and expiration date, ready for online purchases. You can also add the card to Apple Pay or Google Pay to use it in physical stores, just like any other Visa or MasterCard. And remember, there's virtually no limit. You can add as many cards as you like to the same account. Just go to, order new card, and repeat the steps we covered earlier.